Okay, latest DIY project we have the third cigar box amp. Uh, we'll take a look here on the bottom. Uh, we've got some rubber feet. On the front we've got our speaker. I don't know if we can see that, but the grill is actually a piece of porch screen. Um, we've got an LED here with a little washer around it. We've got a recessed jack on the side, a gate handle on the top, or maybe a kind of a garage-like uh, drawer handle, I guess. Um, chicken head knob, I went through several different knobs. I ended up with the chicken head knob, but um, all of them look pretty good. I just thought this was a little more amp-like, I guess you'd say. Uh, this side is nothing. The back, we have our battery door. Um, it's got a nine volt, I can get that open. Nine volt right there. What's nice about this one is it doesn't rattle. Everything is really solid. A couple screws there to hold the box closed. This started life as an acid cigar box. Um, it sat this way. This is actually the top. And this here, what I'm using as the front, is the bottom. And where this whole thing came from was I had the acid box and I found this speaker. It's a five inch Fisher speaker. I'm assuming it's from a home stereo, uh, though I'm not sure. It's a paper cone speaker with an El Nico magnet that I found in a local, um, I guess you'd call it an antique shop, but they had some raw speakers and that was one of them and I really liked it. Um, it was just a neat looking speaker. So I was like, hey, maybe that'll sound cool on an amp. Um, this has the 2.5 watt Artec board that you can buy from CD Giddy and Amazon and a couple other places. A very simple board. Um, it just has a on off switch with a volume knob. That is it. Input jack, LED, and a speaker lead. I mean, that's it's about as simple as you can get. There's actually a trim pot on the board, and I thought about actually mounting that trim pot so you could trim it, you know, from the outside, put it on the side or something, or on the top, whatever. And um, as I actually played with it, the trim pot really doesn't do that much. I mean, it, it does trim it, but I don't see it as something you're constantly going to want to adjust. So I just went with a cleaner look, um, the single here, and um, it actually came out really nice. Um, put some washers with the screws there to kind of give it a little, so you notice the washer, the washers here. There's actually a washer behind the knob here too that are all the same size, so they actually end up looking kind of uniform. But I know that 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 hides the um, that hides the washer. But anyway, after I put this thing together, it actually sounds really good. Um, I was surprised at how good it sounds. The board with that little Fisher speaker, it sounds really good. Um, so let's do a couple of sound clips and and hear this thing. Okay, and for the sake of this demo, um, I'm going to use a a professionally made guitar, I guess you'd say. Normally I use a lot of my homemade instruments, various cigar box guitars or, you know, synth things that I've made or whatnot to test my homemade amps. But because this one really sounds good, I want to use a nice, um, well-made guitar to, to uh, demo it. So this is my Gibson SG Special that you see here. This is one of the best sounding guitars I have ever played. It just sounds fantastic. Um, got the P90s in it. Uh, Gibson wiring and mahogany. It's just, it's a fantastic sounding guitar. So we're gonna use that to demo uh, this little amp. All right, so the only thing we've got between uh, the amp and the guitar is this yellow cable you see. Uh, very pure tone here. So um, we're gonna roll, go to the neck pickup, roll the gain off just a little bit. Try to do a little strumming thing here. So without touching anything on the amp, we are going to uh, turn the, the gain up all the way, roll the tone back just a little, staying on the neck pickup here. Let's see what, if we can get something kind of something kind of buttery here. the bridge pickup here um, let's see here we will crank the tone all or excuse me crank the, the gain all the way roll the tone back just a bit 
Uh, see if we can get some power chord chunk here. Something like that. Just a little, take a hair of all out of the branch. Nice and twangy. 